everyone. As you can see, I'm in my little trailer and it's still raining outside. We've just, uh, yesterday, um, we came out of, uh, we had the first training session after elimination. And um, what happened in elimination was Rena from the black team was voted out. And uh, that was a big shock to, I think, all the contestants. Well, some of them anyway. Certainly um, the red team and the black team because the white team had sort of verbalized that they were you know, going to be voting for blue or something or other and then uh, they decided to do a backflip and vote out to someone from the black team. So of course that set the cat amongst the pigeons. And yesterday when I found this out, it was uh, the first training session of the week where I gave my change hero token to Rob, who really stepped up uh, the previous week and did some great changes. But uh, these guys are on fire now. Now that they've sort of seen that the white team have sort of, I guess, shown their hand, um, my, my boys especially are really fired up to just prove to everybody how you know amazing they can be and how well they can do. And look, I don't care what it takes. Anything that gets them fired up, I'll grab it, harness it, and utilize it in a training session. So, so be it. Um, we, I know that uh, tomorrow, uh, that was yesterday, so today we had a great training session with um, one of my, a personal trainer that I use, Joey, a great dear friend of mine. Um, I've known him for about 15 to 18 years, and they asked me to, on the show to bring out someone that I respect and train with, and that was of course gonna, always gonna be Joey, so um, we, we, uh, we had this fantastic training session. I'm just trying to remember what all happened because just before I took them into the training session with Joey, uh, today I found out that they'd been uh, in a temptation. Here we go again, first temptation of the season. And of course my team, the red team, the noisiest team when they started to reveal what happened. It's always the rules, you know, the, whoever's the noisiest and laughing nervously when they go to tell the trainers what's happened, that's usually the team that ate the most. And guess who was the noisiest? The red team. So they ate the most calories, they won the temptation, which was um, the power to choose which team gets the seafood diet, the grains diet, the red meat diet, or the fruit diet. So they gave fruit to blue team, they gave red meat to white team, because I think they're so pissed with them at the moment. Um, they gave grains to the black team, uh, which they're, I'm pretty sure they're not happy about either. Well, no one's happy about any of it. And they gave themselves seafood, which I guess out of the four is probably the best of a bad bunch. Uh, so anyway, this is this is all the information that we ended up um, dumping on Joey, poor bugger, when we turned up to the training session, he's there waiting for us. But, you know, in, in true Joey fashion, bless his heart, he said, you know what, it's done, it's in the past, let's move on. And that's exactly the right information at the right time, because we need to be able to move on from stuff that happens, that's called life. Check your pulse if it's not happening. If things aren't going or, you know, awry or, you know, disarray, that's, that's just what happens in life and you've got to be able to move on and get on with it. So that's exactly what we did in this amazing training session. Um, uh, we got those guys working so hard. We called it double the trouble because the boy, the, the four four of the Joffreys really couldn't escape this training session. Not that they ever do, but when you've got two trainers and four people, there is no escape. And Joey and I gave them a massive workout. It was so much fun. Uh, so yeah, so that's been the last couple of days here at Biggest Loser. The curveballs just keep coming. We'll talk to you soon. Bye.